ستون مرگرده No ora mai te tu rosun te mari iki ante shakure me te na ya au ke ne soto mani. Hello loves, happy solstice. <laughs> connecting sacred hearts, connecting with mothers. It's a big um a big day today and tomorrow. Connecting the two days, 21st and 22nd. I'm I've written out this portal expansion is happening with um having the full moon uh, back to back with the solstice. This portal that started the 12th is expanding now. And there's, it's almost like um, when I look at, I almost see like double rings, like double portals is what I see. So I don't know if that means two portals or if it just means the expansion and the growth of it. But this is so fantastic what's happening right now. The um, energies that are here to shift and, and have, assist everyone else um everyone every soul to shift in their process um but one of the most important things for you guys to do is to make sure you have that time to just be okay you've got to take that time to sit in meditation and allow these energies just to move through your body tell source tell your guides whoever you're working with the angels say i allow these energies to work through me to assist me in my purging because there's a lot of you out there that are purging there's a lot of people that are just starting their process they haven't even gone to the deep purging yet there are some people that are on the other end everybody is still purging in some way so allow these energies to come in um, that are assisting you because purification is key in this process to move forward in ascension, all right? So if you think you don't have purging to do, <laughs> they're gonna, your guides are gonna come in and be like, uh-huh, and they're gonna whammy you. So <laughs> here you go. Um, Shakari ita sunaya moya a setara una yekete otono o shotura maane. Put those crystals out um, for the full moon. Um, full moon comes at the different time. I know here in the United States it's at 9.49 a.m. on the West Coast tomorrow and I think it was 12.49 p.m. So 12.49 in the afternoon on the East Coast. So get those crystals outside, okay? Get them ready. Um, I already started gathering my, I have so many of them all. <laughs> I have to use this big pizza tray and, and um, stuff. My kids are like, oh my God, we need two of them now. <laughs> so get them out there and uh, get them ready for charging. <sighs> okay, so I want you guys to know something. Um, uh, there's a lot of things I want to tell you, but there is um, this energy that's coming in is to help us moving forward on this planet so that we can shift the energy to move into peace, okay? Um, it's not like, don't take the words I say and say we're going to have peace overnight, okay? This is a process and each person has to participate and every person as they participate and they shift within themselves, it shifts you on the outside as well. So it, 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 it helps the consciousness of Mother Earth, okay? It helps the collective consciousness. It changes the vibration and everything. So if your vibration changes, you change the vibration around you. Um, one of the best things to do with purging, um, releasing, is put everything into Mother 
earth, okay? It's so important to get rid of the stuff that you need to let go of and put it in Mother Earth because she knows exactly what to do with it. She takes it in there and she transmutes it, okay? She transmutes that energy. It's almost like a, I don't want to say it's like a food, but maybe a fuel. <laughs> but when you're giving, you know, and she's taking, make sure that you thank her as well, okay? It's really, really important to always be thankful and grateful. I'm going to be speaking more and more light language as I do these videos because I'm trying to, um, well, I'm not trying, it's just happening. It's part of my uh, work here um, is to help to awaken souls to this I call it the language of love, <laughs> the ancient language of the soul, the language of love. So this is how I will always refer to it as the language of love. You can call it language of light or light language, whatever you want to. For me, it will always be the language of love because it's transferred from my high heart to your high heart. Okay, and then when you start speaking it to someone else, it'll be from your high heart to your high heart. Now, more and more people are starting to speak light language. They're being activated through the videos as they're listening, which is fantastic because this is the only true language there is. This is the language of your higher self. Okay, this is why everybody can speak it. This is why I'm doing this to make sure everybody that listens can receive these, um, these activations that come through me. Now, I have so many different light languages that have been coming in lately. So there's going to be more and more videos with the different ones that I'm going to put out there on YouTube because we want to get everybody on track. Okay, this is part of the light. This is part of this process. We have got to have one universal language. Okay, one. Um, the whole reason we have all the different languages is for segregation. That was part of patriarchal control as well. I've written about it. I've talked about it before. So it's time for us to come back in unity. And how do we do that? We all have to understand each other. Okay, so this is part of the waking process. If you've been listening to my videos for a couple of years and you don't speak it yet, that's okay. You're not ready. Don't worry. Continue your purification. All right. For those of you, I have, I've probably had about 300 people saying, I'm speaking my language now. And a lot are afraid to actually speak it. Some are afraid to speak it on their family. Um, so um, my very good friend, Paul Debris, Carey and I are going to be doing a workshop on light language. He, he understands it all. He actually understands everything I say. So um, he, he's my... Um, we call he does the dictating. <laughs> so we will be doing a workshop, an online workshop, so that you can come on if you're starting to um, speak it. Even if you're not starting to speak it, if you want to learn more about it, it will be available. We will be doing that together in 2019. We have been working wee hours of the night um, and, and together um, on this, and we're being we're getting it ready to present it to you guys. So I hope to see some of you guys there because this is going to be this is part of the big change. Um, and that we're actually going to take to the new earth. So you want to be ready. It's going to, I'm so excited because I'm like, what's my, really my purpose here? You know, we all ask that. And then when it just came through that, the, I'm not going to say exactly what I was told, but the light language is one of the main key reasons for me being here be, besides the other activations, um, the initiations that I do and also activations. So you're all waking to what you're truly here to do. We all are. Some of us have been awake our whole life and we're just finding out now everything. And some of you are just awake and you're like, I want to know now. But give yourself patience, okay? Give yourself time. You have to go through the process. You've got to get rid of that density. And when you're ready, and just continue to keep allowing everything to happen and unfold because you already have that blueprint, the map that you created before you came, everything falls in place. So when you can surrender the want to control everything in your life and just allow things to happen, this is when things really, truly start happening. This is when the shift within you really takes place, okay? So are you ready? Because I've got a download for you guys today. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Some of you guys always say I sound Italian, but I am Italian. I'm Sicilian, so. <laughs> Okay, so I want you to take a deep breath. Breathing in life and allowing love to fall out of the mouth. And when you breathe in the life and then you allow love to fall out, 
you're focusing on that sacred heart and you allow that love to fall out, it changes the energy around you and it changes the vibration in the room. Because when you're putting that thought in there that I am releasing love, isn't that a fantastic thing? You can feel it. You feel that energy swirling around you. So, and also you exude it and you send it out to others when you do that. So take a deep breath in again. Breathe in life and exhale love. And just relax. I'm going to have something, I'm going to have you all do something different today. Okay, I want you to put your palms on your knees, okay? And breathe. And I'm going to do the light language, okay? There's going to be some energies running through. You will feel it running in. A lot of you will feel it coming through and going down your arms and into the palms of your hands. And when it gets there, okay, it's going to go down through um, from your knees, down your legs. You're going to feel the tingling in your feet, okay? This tingling in your feet, when you feel it, take it into the earth star chakra and then root it into mother earth. There's going to be some releasing. That's what you're going to be doing, okay? Takari anto ura kanteni. All right. Thank you. Katona ushantami i te atu ura. Katari inu soto maya i. Sakuna ushutura maya u kawante. Tayani i te daria. Kahana ura santa maratu shi te sisidi. Shikina ura kana santa mara una me. Ma oko ura kara santo sukuru shushua. Shantana i te oraka. Metene, shuture, shakare, taria. Shakene, takure, makare. Tariya. Okuna ke the eighty sukuduna mayasa kana, sukuna sagaranda sagaranda sisiana urutua, baka inta ya ura manakin sisiana osho turutua name, katana kosun to gumasa to kiran tesigaran the titi and ura kana sukwane, shakarakutus to kundutuni and aya aya oa, katakosun to kundutuni and isisi and oda, shakarakuna karasupu yamakin tinsi skundu yamiane, sukarantaya mo ura kirisinti a shooter, tarian the ara, yona mani kin is a gurutu, 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 kra. Some of you may feel that energy really getting in there really deep. This is to assist in purging. It's really, I'm feeling it in me. I just feel it. Ooh. Take it in, allow it to run through you. Say, I allow this energy to run through me and help me with a deep cleansing. Shantyana manya yana hayani Chana kyanta miyana yau Hana hanya hayya heya yau
to uma aya o kutura ne sakura to sukuru mo to uma ya are ki mesisi ano o shuturu kun to menete ni kina ndo su mane ya sakura kun to skana mane kina ndo satoa ya kani ana tete tete kero to to na ya tese tese sante shuturu ma ya. Oh, I felt the solar plexus go woo. Santana uma ya kete ni tiri anto ora kada santo do na makinte su su do na ma hani ni erkerente su koro na kara santa si anto ora su kana ta su kara do su kama sente si kira na ayama ara su kara do na su koro na su koro na sente si si ana o si sente in 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 ar o na ma ya ante in ya tu na ma ya a. Breathe. Rest in the energy. Namarati Shakanati Satua. We give to you Kutunumana Uramene Ite, all that is. Kashanta Arekina Marata, Yu Umaeki, and all that you shall be. For more I am a Sakanta Dirudu. For you always have been. Satine Ikatara, Ukudun, my sente she to do, my Yakitine. You are the light and love of the one. Tamaude se ya uaia, ya o mayatana, Shantana ita. I feel some of you do shock throat chakras again. <coughs> Ooh. You're going to start feeling this. If you feel it, start coughing. Shantona. Ma anya ete. Release it all. Mukuma. Let it go. There is no fear anymore in speaking your truth. Truth is love. Na akitera no umane. And truth is peace. Na tena ira uwa mane, shuntuna ya kia tata na tena. Release all of it as the past, for it no longer matters. As we move forward into the light, into the vibration of oneness, love, divinity, mahako tene ira, shuntura na ya u. Kantaniente era. Kunala taratita chukutu. Sukune si sisiano uru ne naore na. Okay, I need some water. <laughs> Ooh, I was really feeling your throat chakras there, guys. Um, and I know there may be some newer people in here that haven't gone through a lot of the clearing yet, but the throat chakra is one of the biggest um, areas that people 
have um, either blocked it themselves. I want to say yes, most of them block themselves, and some of them are blocking it subconsciously um, from past life stuff, um, just out of fear, out of fear of speaking your truth for what has gone on in um, on in your lives, in past lives, you know, have taken your lives away for speaking your truth or for being who you truly were. Um, also for, um, in this life, a lot of people don't speak their truth because as a child, they were suppressed as well. It doesn't matter if you're a man or a woman. If you had a parent that told you children are supposed to be seen and not heard, you get programmed that way. So you you stay quiet, you know, or if you always had someone telling you, shh, don't say anything or don't speak up or keep that a secret, shh, children get programmed. And this is why we should not do this to children. They take it through their life and then we have that blockage okay, on the throat chakra. There's a lot of other things as well, but those are just some little ones that I file. I find that a lot with my clients. Um, a lot of parents did that. It was just part of the programming, and um, it's time to stop that. We need to allow our children to speak. We need to allow them to play and do what they want to. Let them speak. Let them have their imagination. Let them tell you stories. Let them talk about someone who they might be saying they have a friend that they're talking to and you can't see them. Well, they probably can, okay? So just remember that it's usually not their imagination. It's usually something real. Allow them to tell you and don't judge them. That is the other worst thing in this world that souls do is judge. And when you're judging another, you're only judging yourself, okay? Because you're reflecting, you're gonna get that reflection right back. And for those that don't see it, start thinking about that, okay? You're sitting out there judging somebody else for what they do or what they say or whatever. Just remember, you just judge that person, okay? So now you gotta turn around and look at yourself in the mirror, all right? Um, I did it the other day when I was at the store and somebody like rammed their card into me. She was like, I was, I was like, oh my goodness, that was really rude. And I was like, okay, maybe she's in a hurry. <laughs> you know, I had to stop and I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna send her love. She might be like running through, maybe she's gotta pick her kids up from school. So, I mean, it's those little things. So we have to think about that. Just, you know, send the person love. And, and go on. But really, take a look at yourself when you're doing that stuff because it's really, really important. These are things you have to release. And this is all part of this process. Okay. Um, I see you guys are. Um, uh, hi, Catherine. Hi, Claudia. Tara. Simona. Um, thank you. Thank you, Mother Earth. Can I speak light language? But everyone can speak light language every single person. This is the universal language of love. This is the only language that is real. I'm answering her question because she must have missed in the beginning when I talked about this, okay? We all speak it. That is when our higher self is talking, okay? When it is the real light language, it just flows through us. It's our higher self talking through, okay? So when you start speaking it, know that you're starting to connect with your higher self, okay? Really important that everybody knows that. Don't try and force it. Allow it to just happen. Some people aren't ready yet, okay? And it's okay, but you will speak it. There are children that are already speaking it. And I'm hoping that um, to do a workshop with the children too, because it's really important to keep the children speaking it um, because they're gonna start having the conversations with the parents that are just waking and this is, you're gonna learn it. Um, like I said, Paul and I are working on um, the language. Um, we're working wee hours of the night. I mean, sometimes up to one in the morning with him speaking light language to him and he's dictating it and he is breaking it down. He knows he's got in like six weeks that we've been doing this, he's got enough language of a four year old's um, vocabulary so far in six weeks. So when you think of that, that's how quick he's picking it up. So we have like the translation of it. This is the language that cannot be manipulated by the dark energy. And this is why it's important to listen to these videos, to receive the activations. It's so important. I can't even stress it, okay? This is going to the new earth. And this is the language we will be speaking, okay? Shaka na utakarente si kiyo no moya yahikinte. All right, so a lot of this stuff, <laughs> I'm going to switch now. Um, a lot of uh, the energies that are coming through, that are flowing in here with... Um, 
the solstice. And there's lots of solstice celebrations going out there. I know a lot of people go to Glastonbury up at the Stonehenge and stuff. And I think that's so cool. If I was out there, I'd probably go as long as I had like, you know, a little heater that was like battery operated because I don't like the cold. <laughs> um, and um, people go and they, they wait for the morning sunrise for that. And um, there's um, uh, Yule log solstice traditions on the Christmas tree that the pagans started. It's not started by pagans. It wasn't started by the, the churches or anything or religions. Um, look into the history of that stuff. Um, it's really kind of cool when you when you learn those things and you um, then you can go out and have your own celebrations. I have Archangel Gabriel just popped in next to me. Ooh, I'm starting to really vibrate. <laughs> Okay, thank you. Uh, Archangel Gabriel is the messenger angel, and he's the one that came in. Um, he brings divine messages and light. Okay. He's holding his hands out like this, and he's got the gold energy coming out. So it's gold and white. Little purification ritual. And the blessing. We see you in the divine light that you are. We love you in your divinity. We honor your sacred soul and we bless you for your participation upon Mother Earth. Tamayi tuwe sikia taratani u. In unity, all create the change. Tamakiya sushuna tarayampe ikiti noro u. Brothers and sisters, we are one. We always have been, and we always will be. In the sacred light of love, know that you are grace that walks upon the earth. Know that your soul is pure, it always has been. And know that the density is dissipating. Katame Ariti Yakuba. Wow, that was really strong. <laughs> I'm looking at the crystals all over my hands. I don't know if any of you, oh, yes, I'm just like going off. Um, there's like, have you guys seen the crystals in your hands? I don't know if you can see them on here. It might not be, it, this not, might not be that, it might not be good lighting, but I like, my entire body is covered with the crystallization process now. Um, and the different colors are amazing. So um, if you have sunlight, you can get out there. I mean, you can see the difference. I mean, Shotura Mayahikiya. You can see the difference in your skin um, now. It's amazing, just little crystals all over. And uh, I call this crystallization process the process of the Christ within you, okay? Because we're becoming light like Christ. Um, we're bringing in this, this liquid light um, and uh, we are shining like the stars that we are. I keep looking at myself because I see these little sparkles all over. And, and I, since a little girl, have loved anything sparkly. So no wonder. <laughs> Probably knew this was coming. Okay, let me see what you guys have to say here. Shatonam ayakita. 
atyanta. Oh, solar plexus. Oh, good, Claudia. So you were feeling that this that with the solar plexus. I felt too. I felt like those the solar plexus just went woo. Um, because everything that I do, I feel so I know what's being worked on. Um, fantastic. I'm glad you guys are feeling that. Okay, good. If you're guided to do something when you're listening, definitely do it. Listen to your guidance, okay? I just start you out and um, to, to get you going and then do whatever your guides tell you or if you're working with angels, okay? There goes my nose running. Whenever I channel, my nose runs. I still have Gabriel here in the, in the side of me. Hello, everyone. I see you. Hello from Romania. Hello, Shakati Ita from Northern Ireland. Hello, Stacy. Lovely. Takarate ne Ita Dora. Randy Reinhoff, I know you're from far away as well. Shatena Adakua. Ah, Randy, good question. So, what's happening? You're saying there's so many different light languages. Is yours the right one? Well, I the the one that's being created. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> um, I speak all the different light languages, okay? But we are taking all of them and creating the universal one. There is a universal one. Now there's different ones from different origins and I've been speaking so many of them. I've actually started speaking the, um, what is it called? Uh, the mantoid, <laughs> that's the, um, the big prey mantis. I don't know if you guys know about the prey mantis, but they're like the most loving beings. They're huge. For those of you who, who can see, you can see them on the earth and they're like as big as a building, okay? Um, I've had them come to me a couple times and they've embedded codes in me. I receive these embeddings of codes. Darn, I should start bringing tissues. Um, and then I speak it. So I've been speaking mantoid now and they're, they're so... They are, their love is so unconditional. All you feel is divine love from them. And the whole reason that, like I said before, the chemicals and everything started was to get rid of these things. Um, that they're spraying on our plants and everything. So don't put chemicals on your plants because we're killing them. Their frequency is so high and all they are is love. They come here for love, okay? Same with the whales and the dolphins. And I've talked about that before and why they do all of the harp stuff under the sea to, to throw them off so that they they end up killing themselves. So I'm not going to go off on that stuff right now because it's not the time, but the language that is coming in, in the workshop, we will explain um, how you know this is the one because uh, I can't say. <laughs> There's certain things I just can't say. They're like, you're not ready yet, so I can't say. Um, but uh, there is one universal one and it is being created and I am working with the creator. <laughs> um, basically, I am connected with, I've been with Yeshua, Buddha, Mother Mary. Let me tell you, uh, Maha Shohan, I've been up in that energy with them way up and bringing this stuff through. So like I said, we've been, he's dictating everything that's coming through. And, and this is one of the main reasons I came back. So um, also for me to be able to bring in all the different light languages, it's so that all of you start getting activated and then eventually you'll, you'll pick up the other light language just like that. Because even if there's different light languages, that's still like a little bit of segregate, segregation. So we have to bring it all into one. So the one is being created right now. And I am doing that on, um, to wee hours of the night. So just know that um, when I sign off or somewhere, if I'm not doing something else, I'm still working. And then I get on a ship at night. <laughs> a lot of us do. <laughs> All right. Uh, so I want to make sure you guys um, actually get into... Uh, I'm just seeing what some of you guys are saying here. Pam, oh, you're doing the light language symbols. That's okay, because eventually you will, you will start speaking it. So that's okay. Norway. Costa Rica, hello. Shatara to uwa. I cut my nose as soon as I channel, my gosh. 
Once there are 10 air estate, there are no meal. Make it a sit on my hickey. There's your response. Na aqua. Tataritina ayaua. Maui. Hi, Jewel. Sister. Sister of the Rose. <laughs> She's one of our new initiates. The Karatini. Sicily. Oh, Emmy, I'm Sicilian. <laughs> If any of you say anything in light language on here, I'm going to respond to you because it's my higher self just responds like that in an instant. So if I see light language or if I hear someone talking it or trying to talk it, my response is so quick now because I'm just connected. I'm like merged with the higher self and it's just like boom, boom, boom. I don't hold it back. I just allow because I am who I am. I am that I am and I am doing what I'm supposed to be doing. So if you write something here, I, I, you're going to get a response, okay? Nakaratasi. Bulgaria. Very nice. Okay. Walla Walla, Washington. Joanne, um, we are going to be doing a workshop, okay, with the light language. So, Joanne Cook, yes, um, you're, you're starting doing the signs. There's a lot of people that start the signing first, and then the um, speaking it will come later, okay? And that's fantastic. Just allow it to come. The more you allow, um, the better you will get, okay? You just, you continue to keep opening. So, Paul and I are getting ready. It's going to be 2019. We already started working on some stuff um, and we're going to try, we're going to do a Zoom workshop so we can get as many people on there as we can, okay? He's in Malaysia right now, so um, we have to try and uh, do it when it's not like rainy season. <laughs> and I think uh, January and February are not rainy season because their power is always going out over there with those thunderstorms. So yes, you, we are going to do the best we can to get everybody on board to understand what they're doing. South Africa, Cape Town. Hello, Nadine. Takaratua. Ernie, Ohio. Probably not far from you, Ernie. Sakadatea. <laughs> Arcadia. Wonderful. Germany. Okay. Miami. Yay. New Zealand, wonderful. Netherlands. I've been to Netherlands, yes. I love the Netherlands. Okay, so I want to make sure that you guys get into this meditation today when we're done here, okay? Because the activations that are that we're bringing in today are also going to sit you. It's going to be a double, triple whammy with the portal and the full moon and all these energies coming in. And also there's meteor showers um, coming in tonight. So how fantastic that. If you have clear skies, go watch them. I think they're the next couple days. I know my friend Todd had told me about that as well. Um, they've sprayed so much here that you can't even see through the clouds. So I've got to call in the slip angels, see if we can get that cleared up. But I'm going to bring in some more and then I'm probably going to be done. I'm going to have a little water first. Start your breathing. There's a little being in my room over here looking at me. It's so sweet. It's just, it's little. I've never seen one this little. Hi. Oh, it's talking. It's almost like a child, the energy of it. Little light beam. No, oh, da, 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 da. okay, it's speaking. It's speaking to me. I'm going to speak it to you. I'm trying bringing. So the language it's speaking, I'm going to actually speak it to you. 
It's so much love. It's just all love. I'm trying to find out where this being is from. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, it's trying to send through. Some of you need some heart stuff. <laughs> it's bringing in some heart stuff. I, I want to say, you know, sometimes they show me a little bit of form. This one's showing me its feet. Feet almost look like um, elephant. <laughs> but it's a light thing, but the feet keeps like lighting up the little feet like elephant. One, two, three. Thank you. It's done. So incomplete. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Little surprise. Must have come through the portal. Yeah. <laughs> Sakana <laughs> Okay, I need whoever is taking in the healing to say I accept this healing from Kilina so you don't block it. This is actually a frequency change when I do that. Tokurutenme. Sakana. I still feel <coughs> throat chakra stuff from you guys. <coughs> so if you're feeling itchiness in your throat or like a block in your throat, like a tightness or <coughs> like you have stuff coming up, please cough because I feel it and it stops me. I also feel a lot of you, you're, that solar plexus, from that solar plexus thing, I feel that's still releasing too. Let that stuff go. Deep breath in. Breathe in life and exhale love. Keep going. Mashutana. All right, we're going to do a frequency change again. We're going to continue. So that I mean, is it to do my day? The girl to talk is that I need to get a day. Miss Kuru to go to the girl to get a day. So the girl to get a 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 Goes in through your DNA at the cellular level to activate, to awaken, suppress, storm, or dormant DNA. Okay, so that's what that just was. Shantana Ura. <laughs> These are frequency changes. Shah oh Akia. Mm. 
I want you to close your eyes and just breathe and listen with the heart, okay? Allow that to come in. I've got solar plexus stuff coming up on you guys. Naokote ne ita. Ukonte ne ahi. Shuntura mahia. Moyaki. Ooh, big heart opening. Nakatane. Stay in the higher vibrations, keep those hearts open, focus on what you want to change, focus on what you're creating for the new earth. For those of you that are purging, keep letting go. Allow that light in, open up, allow those embedded crystalline codes within you, that Christ light, turn on that light. It's time. No, Bate. Na oka bore ni si dere ni atu ora materi te ri atu kuru sinto masanta. Shikana tu shi masiti inte ma ai kata. Kia na ora kuru sinto tu mane dere ni atu. Na e kua. We are the love and light of one. Na ai kata. Shuma. Love and blessings, everyone. This winter solstice and this full moon. May you all have wonderful holidays. May you gather with your families, whether it be um, families that you were born into or your new families of light, spiritual families, because I know a lot of us have lost our families because they don't understand us. I I know exactly what you mean. And so um, I wish you all the wonderful, the best, and um, stay in these energies. Keep your vibration up. It's so very important right now. Um, allow everything to just work through you, feel these energies, and um, do the best you can when you're out and about to stay in your light. Like I said, no more judging, okay? If you do do it, just turn around, look at yourself and go, oh my gosh, okay, I need to work on that, okay? We're all releasing, we're all purging, everybody's going through the process. Um, like me, that was that little tiny trigger that I have in the, in the store. I was like, oh. <laughs> so uh, when you see it, recognize it, acknowledge it, um, and work on yourself, okay? Um, and one of my favorite songs that I love to listen to is Man in the Mirror. That's one of my kids' favorite songs. Um, by Michael Jackson. You know, we make the change. The first change you make is by in yourself. You look at yourself in the mirror. So listen to that song because Michael Jackson was very awake and he wrote those to help awaken people. Um, when you get off here, go over and turn that on. Um, also, I have finally, I haven't told people, but I, I finally turned, put the PayPal buttons back on my website. I'm now booking for the ses for booking sessions again. I shut it off down back in, um, early November because I was booked through December. It is back open. However, it's been open for a few days and people have already noticed and started booking. So I'm already booking in February. That's how quickly it goes. It goes boom, boom, boom. So if you've been waiting, um, don't wait because if you wait, think I'm going to wait a month, you may be not have until March or April. Okay. So I just wanted to let everybody know that because people have been waiting. And um, please give the girl that helps me 
time. She is a student and um, she's taking finals and she's in sick. So um, give her a little bit of patience. So kada in na ora tene ama ora ya kinte isi ya na o shotona moya a. Mahakatana eta shua ya hiki. We are the love and light of one. Sakana une satere usukuna mahia taya ukutuna sa. We have always been shotona aya o and we always will be shakana esi ata. Kia o na mahia tinti kiro tuna santo. Kia kim. Open your hearts to love. Tatiya. Eternal love. Eternal light. Eternal life. Oh, I love you. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Whatever you celebrate. I will see you in 2019. Bye, everyone. <laughs>